Hi Virgo, welcome to my channel. This is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking and subscribing. I truly appreciate your love and support. Virgo, today we are going to find out how does your person currently feel about you and there will be an extended reading on my Patreon page. Link is in the description box below. Alright Virgo, let's get your reading started. Spirits and angels, please show me how does uh, Virgo's person currently feel about Virgo. The star. Show me more. Ace of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck. Okay, Virgo. So the star, they definitely feel like you're one of a kind. You could be their wish of perhaps wanting to heal this connection with you. Mm. But we've got the Queen of Swords in reverse. They feel like either you haven't forgiven them, you're still holding grudges towards them, or that you're angry with them, okay? But they definitely feel like they want to heal this connection. And the star, I always read it as, you know, you shine the brightest, perhaps. Uh, they may have other options, okay? They may have dated other people, but I feel like they still find you to be the best, okay? Six of Pentacles, Sema Verse. They feel like you no longer are giving to them, you're no longer supporting them. But we've got the judgment here as well. So it may, it also looks like, you know, Virgo, please bear in mind, roles can be reversed in this reading, okay? Could either be how your person feel about you, how you feel about them. But judgment is here. So they feel like they want to either talk to you or wanting to reconcile with you, getting back together. Definitely somebody whom you are in separation with currently. Yeah, it looks like you're angry with them with the Queen of Swords in reverse, holding a lot of grudges. We've got the Ten of Cups here. This means that Virgo, actually, they feel like you are part of their family or that they want you to be a part of their family or be a family together or being with each other long term. Ten of Cups indicates, you know, uh, happily ever after. So perhaps they feel like they want to heal this connection. They may kind of know with the Six of Pentacles and Rumpers that they may not have treated you fairly in the past and they may be thinking about reconciliation. There are few cards here that could indicate that. And Ace of Cups here in reverse. Hmm. They feel like you no longer love them or that, you know, perhaps at one point in time you may have um, loved them a lot or, you know, sincere, genuine in the beginning of the relationship and look very romantic, lovey-dovey, but it's in reverse. Either they feel like you've rejected them or you could go vice versa. Definitely feel a loss, okay? They feel like they've lost their one true love. Yeah. Also, I'm sensing they find you to be irreplaceable, that's for sure. Ace of Pentacles, they want to offer you this new beginning, commitment, hoping i feel like it's hoping because the star could indicate hope and faith having faith or hoping definitely hoping or wishing that both of you could start over hash some things out with the judgment here and then eventually reconciling this person definitely feels that they want to be with you long term however four pentacles is in reverse they feel like either they could have dropped the ball or that you have let go of this connection. Eight of Pentacles in reverse. They feel like you're not focusing on them currently. Now Pentacles in reverse. They could be sensing that they need you in some way, shape, or form. There's a bit of a needy card when it's in reverse, like codependency, okay? And also, all of these Pentacles are in reverse, right? And this is actually your energy, Earth. So it may look like just you no longer invest you know no longer paying them attention no longer giving them what you used to give because you're all in reverse so there's only one that's in the upright position so i feel like this is the hope and wish that perhaps both of you can start over okay we've got the seven of wands here in reverse i feel like you no longer are even <laughs> fighting for this connection anymore Three of Pentacles in reverse. Yep, you don't want to compromise. You don't want to meet in the middle. They feel that maybe you don't want to reconcile with them. Okay. Hmm. Two of Cups in reverse. Definitely, both of you are not together right now. Look, you got Ten of Pentacles. You got Ten of Cups here at the same time. 
you are their person, Virgo. They really want you. I feel like they see again forever with you, retiring with you, building something together, starting a family. But if both of you have a family in the past, I mean, have children together in the past, if both of you were married, then they want to maintain that. Okay. If you're not, then they see this potential of being together long term. But there are a lot of cards here. The four ones here in reverse, two of cups in reverse, a lot of cards that indicate you and this person are not together right now. Okay. And I've got the King of Cups in reverse. They feel like they really want to talk to you and express to you how they truly feel. But also at the same time, Virgo, I feel like the separation has made them feel um, really sad. I would say the King of Cups in reverse is a very sad king because he may not be emotionally stable at this point in time. He or she is not gender specific, okay? Eight of Cups. So they feel like you've already walked away or that you're moving on. You made a choice, two of wands in reverse, to walk away. This is you, Virgo, king of pentacles. Again, doesn't matter, king or queen is not gender specific. For some of you, this may be um, a same gender relationship, okay? For some of you, only perhaps for about 10% of you. So Virgo, they definitely feel like you're somebody reliable, logical, responsible, somebody who has money, okay? Again, look at all these cards here. They definitely have really good feelings about you, Virgo, but somebody may have messed up in the past because if not, why would you be upset with them, right? Queen of Swords here in reverse. So they know that you're upset with them, but they also know that you are the one for them. They want to be with you long term. You got another pair here, Queen of Cups and the King of Cups. And reverse indicates maybe both of you not speaking to each other right now, not seeing eye to eye, or not connecting physically right now. But energy is still there. And we've got the Queen of Wands, Virgo. If they feel like this is you, for some of you, that could be a third party, not all of you, okay? Like maybe 20% of you, there is a third party. I do read the Queen of Wands as the third party. Um, the other man or the other woman, but Queen of Wands could also be just you, Virgo. They feel like you're very attractive, okay? You're very attractive. They, um, they find you very powerful as well with the Queen of Wands because Queen of Wands is very powerful. And they feel that you may be taking charge right now with your life. Also, I'm sensing them feeling you may have stepped up in the past, okay? I feel like in the past, you may have been the Queen of Cups, okay? Queen of Cups can indicate somebody very delicate or very empathetic, very kind, very nurturing. Also, somebody sensitive, okay? Somebody who loves uh, deeply and genuinely, and the list goes on, but they feel like you could have stepped up from being the Queen of Cups, but the Queen of Cups can be quite vulnerable, okay, sometimes. So they feel like you're stepping up from being the Queen of Cups to becoming the Queen of Wands. The Queen of Wands is more confident, okay, very brave. Um, it's almost like unleashing the fire, because it's a fire, fire energy, okay, it could be unleashing your fire, it could be any sorts of fire, or unleashing fire on them. <laughs> Maybe because you're upset with them, right? But they definitely find you very attractive. Let's see more. Yeah. I was going to say, I would see, I mean, I was not going to say that, but in my head, I was like, I'm going to see the, the Empress. So the Empress is right here, Virgo. So it does look like they feel you're the one. You're definitely the one that they want to be with. Long term, you're beautiful, very nurturing. You have grown as well. The Empress could indicate growth. You have grown to become who you are now, even more beautiful, even more abundant. And they see it much clearer now than ever. But it's after you've moved on, though, with the Eight of Cups here. Yeah? Oh, Cups in my first thing. I have a little bit of a hope, yeah? I do sense them hoping that both of you could reconcile, could get back together and fix things. But the justice system of verse here, Virgo, you may be, if you were married to this person, maybe both of you are separated or getting a divorce. But justice system of verse could just indicate someone was not treating the other person very fairly. Yeah, and for some of you, it could mean that this person, your person, may have cheated with the third party, okay? 
some of you not all of you but we've also got the king of wands here there's a lot there are a lot of pairs so we've got the queen of cups king of cups and we've got the king of wands and the queen of wands ultimately virgo uh your person actually feels that you are very compatible with them okay regardless what had happened uh, especially being compatible in bed okay but emotionally there may have been some issues or someone not treating somebody fairly here and for some of you it could be the third party situation uh, Virgo we're gonna take this um, reading to the extended we're gonna find out what is your person's true intentions towards you and what is the most likely outcome between the two of you and some advice if you're interested link is in the description box below you can just click on it and it will take you to my patreon page this is for um, the gold and platinum member okay gold and platinum members so you can choose either or whichever you like and you'll be able to view this video all right virgo um if you resonated uh, please hit like, share, and subscribe, and I hope to see you at the extended. If not, I will see you back here. Take care. Bye, Virgo.